Now we hear from two members of the Calhoun County community here to talk to us about an event supporting the awareness of domestic violence. Welcome to Community Crossroads. Thank you, Carolina. Thanks for having us. Well, it's great to see you, Ms. Kathy Pullen, yes, the pit master for Pullen Barbecue, mm -hmm. and Ms. Maria Walton. You're with the Herbert Children's and Victims Alliance. Children's Alliance and Victim Center. Ch Children's Alliance. It's and a Victim tongue twister. Center. It's, a, yes. it's a long name. We tend to shorten it to the Harbor. And it's a nonprofit organization. Yes, located in Port Lavaca. So y'all have teamed up. Mm -hmm. You've been doing uh, an event, this event, for several years, but this is one of uh, the first collaborations you're doing. Second year with them. Second year mm -hmm. with them, with Harbor mm -hmm. to collaborate to raise funds in hopes of getting a shelter for women yes. in Calhoun County. Yes, ma'am. I mean, it's an important need. There are so many different types of domestic violence, and until you find a, a little bit of spark in yourself to be able to break free, you need that person to be able to go to to help you get that done because it's not an easy thing. You know, the harbor is able to do a lot of outreach and services, but they don't have that immediate need for somebody to go in that has just been brutally beaten to spend the night and hide. You know, they have to work with the police department to send them to other cities. And so we need something that will work to help women and their families all at once, not to have to separate them. Do you all have a potential site in mind and in, in a location at this point yet? Not at this point. It's still um, it's still fairly new. Mm -hmm. um, she called us last year and approached us with you know the idea, um, and so we've just been taking it one step at a time, trying to you know first you have secure, obviously secure the funds, and then be able to find a location that's going to be safe for um, the people that we're going to serve. Do you all have uh, a target fundraising wise? Uh, that's what we were just discussing. You know, it, it depends on if we can find a family that, you know, the parents have passed on and the kids don't want the property and they're willing to donate it to the 501c for the tax write-off and then we can remodel and rehabilitate that. That's what a few other counties have done that I've worked with. Um, or if we have to start from the ground up. You know, last year we raised 10000 My goal this year is to raise twenty, and that will put us 30 towards our goal. Um, but I know it's going to take a lot, whether we have a house donated or we start from the scratch. Um, I we're hoping within five years we have realistic, tangible numbers and something that we can say, hey, this is what we're going for, here's the property, and this is what we need. It but can be a, a life-saving difference. It can be. Um, you know, I'm a survivor of 25 years of domestic violence. It started at age 15, and I didn't get out till age 40. And back in those days, if you had your children and you needed to flee, I had to go to a homeless shelter. That was not safe. I, was, I felt safer at home with my abuser, so we need to find safe havens for these folks. It can't just be a friend's house or? Not necessarily, no, because a friend is, their spouse is more, more than likely gonna know where your friend lives. It needs to be somewhere anonymous where the police have to take them um, um, in an dis undisclosed location. Well, let's go ahead and share those event details yes. so we can get y'all just another step closer, hopefully several steps closer to that goal. This event is going to be starting at 6 o'clock at the Port O'Connor Community Center on September 30th. Tickets are between $10 to $25 and we'll have more posted on our website with a link to the uh, to the event where mm -hmm. you can purchase those tickets. We'll have that all on crossroadstoday.com. Thank you all so much for making it on the show. Well, and thank you for having us. You. We appreciate it. And sharing the details. Thank you. Thanks. All right, coming up, don't go anywhere. We hear from some Victoria College pirates. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> 